Good evening, I'm Bruce Cates. The final felony charge that was filed against former Texas Governor Rick Perry has been dismissed. Today, the Texas Court of Criminal Appeals dismissed abuse of power charges against Perry. The case stemmed from a veto that the former governor carried out to cut state funding for the Travis County District Attorney's Public Corruption Unit. Well, we don't know who was the lone finalist for the position of CEO at uh, CPS Energy, but we do know that person will not be taking the job. CPS Energy had a list of eight candidates to replace outgoing CEO Doyle Benneby. That was whittled down to one, and now, in a story by Brendan Gibbons in the San Antonio Express News, we're told the candidate has withdrawn from consideration. The Express News story says salary was the main obstacle. The CPS Energy Board will meet next Monday to determine their next final steps. For more information, go to klrn.org news.